Hey everybody, Fishman here. Welcome to another video. A short while ago, I posted a video. It was entitled, My Worst COVID Aquarium, and this was it. This is what I was presented with when I was asked to come in by the client and assess whether or not I can salvage this, or whether or not it needed to be completely thrown out and uh, build a new system for them. I told them it was going to take a fair amount of work, but the tank itself was sound, and I could get it nice and clean, and have it presentable for when the well the bosses came by and had a look and this is what they saw they said yeah this is good this is uh, what we need unfortunately at the time we were in a lockdown and they were not sure or actually none of us were sure when they were actually going to open up so some time went by and i told them uh, throughout this time that i needed about six weeks to get an aquarium presentable and have everything reasonably balanced but as in all things, uh, they have many things they need to take care of and uh, get ready for when they open up for their clients. And aquariums are rarely anywhere near the top of the list. I did actually get uh, a little bit of the time I wanted, but it was not enough. I warned, you know, some things could go wrong. It would be salvageable, but it would, you know, not necessarily be the best look for when they opened up. And lo and behold, we ended up with an algal bloom. Not a serious one, uh, but this is obviously not something that they want uh, for their clients because uh, you know they want everything nice and clean and pristine. And I said, don't worry about it. In a couple of days, I can easily get this cleared up. And my favorite way of doing that now is with a diatom. And this is after one charge. And you're going to see as this progresses, it doesn't take long at all. As a matter of fact, I think by the end of it all, it took uh, a little over a day uh, so i was going in about twice a day and each charge you can see it's getting uh, considerably cleaner now it does not get rid of the cause the obviously the aquarium itself is unbalanced and it will take the six weeks to get it to the point where it will be perfectly fine but fortunately uh, they are closed uh, from friday to uh, the end of monday so there's a nice long weekend there and I can go in and drop this thing in on Thursday, like late Thursday after they're ready to close. And it will uh, do its job and keep it nice and clean, or a lot cleaner anyway. And it'll be <laughs> more than enough to keep it nice and clear, as you're going to see in the last clip coming up here, uh, for their clientele. And then I'm going to put, obviously, a lot of decor in here, a lot more plants in the high humidity planter. And as you can see, it's nice and clear. This is a day and a half later, and the number of charges you can see there, it's, uh, this is fine. This is uh, quite presentable, and I will put in the rocks and get all the, the plastic plants and everything else they want in here, and I'll do all the other work up in here, which will help balance out an awful lot. And like I said, in about six weeks, which is going to be about another four weeks almost from this time, uh, it'll be fine. I'll do you another update for that uh, when that time comes and you can have a look at, it, at its final look. Uh, as I said in the other video, the internals will all be their choice. Uh, you can see one poor female. Johanna is getting a bit of a beating. I'll probably end up taking her up and put something else in, but it's more than presentable now. So thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next video and bye for now.